Ladies, uh, you'll remember my next guest as the brainy investigator from CSI Miami. And he was also a sexy stripper in the Magic Mike movie. Yeah. Now he's playing Laz Delgado on everybody's favorite show, Empire. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Adam Rodriguez. <laughs> All right, this is a nice place to be. Yeah. How, how is it for you, man, being a new guy in everybody's favorite oh, show? Myself included. I mean, I, I, this is my favorite show on television. Yeah. I just couldn't have been more excited. It's, it's a great character. The guy's name is Laz Delgado. He's a concert promoter who comes in to help Cookie out as she's trying to define herself uh, with the Lion Dynasty. And um, he, he comes in and... and, and basically sells himself to her in more ways than one. And uh, a <laughs> little relationship might ensue there. And uh, yeah, things, things get very interesting. This isn't your first time working with Taraji, is it? No, this isn't. We did, uh, we did a Tyler Perry movie a few years back called I Can Do Bad All By Myself. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And, and, and we, had, we had such a great time. We really became close friends. She is really And really getting a chance to work person. together again was something I was really looking forward to. So we've, we've, been, having, we've been having a ball. I mean... Yeah, I bet uh, you have been having a ball. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How them love scenes going? You know, it is always a little bit awkward to, uh, to be doing a love scene with, um, with somebody you hold so dear. Um, and so I think we've just been having fun playing games with each other, you know, uh, trying to see who can make their breath the, the most difficult to deal with. Um, you know. Are you serious, man? <laughs> you know, you know how I mean, these love scenes are really awkward. You're in a room with 30 people, so there's nothing intimate about it. No, so you, you no. got to try and have fun and, and, and make it as comfortable for both of you as possible. In life, though, you're yeah. engaged. You got beautiful yeah, and, fiance. Yeah, in real life. Yeah. How's that all? Yeah, thanks. Thanks. How, how, how's she dealing with all this, you know? Because, oh, she's you know, great. steamy scenes. She's so secure, and she knows, you know, she knows she's number one, and when what we have is, uh, you know, that's everything. So yeah. she's, she's not worried about any of it. She's, she's really yeah. she's able to handle it with ease. Yeah, she's, she's stressing right there. I think, it, I think it helps a lot, too, when they're at the mall with the credit card. I think that, you know, or, or, or at home with the 18-month-old baby. You know, that, that's a good anchor, too. Oh, is it? Oh, that's pretty good. Congratulations, <laughs> Thanks, man. man. I didn't know yeah. that. Yeah. I didn't know that. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. that's a good Thanks, deal, man. man. Thanks, man. Oh, that's a good-looking kid. Hey, man, you, you've come a long way since your first job. <laughs> yeah. That job was a, I was a DJ at a strip club, at a, a female strip club. When I was about 16, I, it, there was a... That's the story I won't talk yeah. about. <laughs> so tell, tell me how that happened. And, and, oh, by the way, your parents are in the audience. They are in the audience, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, they know about this now. Yeah, they didn't know about it at the time, but there was a, there was a strip club locally that, uh, that some friends and I would sneak into from time to time. And, I saw they were looking for a DJ, and I had all my own records and my equipment, and I went in there, and, uh, and I got a job as a DJ when I was about 16 and, and did that for a short while. Uh, man, 16? Fun, man. At a I mean, at that age, yeah, it was... God almighty. It was uh, <laughs> talk, a lot of jealous friends. Talk about the wheels of steel. <laughs> Coming to the stage. <laughs> yeah, 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 man. I gotta tell you, man, I'm really proud of you. Thank you. Because I have watched you for a long time. The, the clarity with which you operate, man, it's just a great example of what men can be in Hollywood. You know, I just think you've done a great job of it, man. Hey, really listen, everybody, this. you can catch Empire on Fox Wednesday nights at 9, 8 Central. We'll be right back. My man, Ed Rodriguez, in the building.